What's up everybody? This is Chris Biederman of the Sacramento Bee with your 49ers post-game buzz following their 26 to 23 loss to the Seattle Seahawks to end mercifully the, the 2020 season for San Francisco. They finished six and 10. On Sunday, it was, it was an odd game uh, because the 49ers went into the, the fourth quarter leading nine to six, and then of course wound up losing 26 to 23. The Seahawks put together three straight touchdown drives at the end of the game behind some magic from Russell Wilson, uh, who really struggled for most of the game with the exception of, of that fourth quarter. The 49ers um, at one point put together four straight scoring drives. The problem, of course, is three of those scoring drives are field goals, um, and they got a touchdown late in the game from Jeff Wilson Jr. That sort of put window dressing on the score before failing to get the onside kick um, with a minute left. But the defense, for the most part, played well, allowed just 280 yards on the game, four of 12. Uh, third down conversions. Uh, C.J. Beather got his second start to finish the season, 25 of 37, 273 yards, and a touchdown pass going to Wilson, who had uh, 20 runs for 76 yards, and then added three catches for 12 yards. 49ers finished 6-10. and 10. Um, They're likely to be without their defensive coordinator, Robert Sala, moving forward. He's going to start getting head coaching interviews starting on Monday with the Atlanta Falcons, according to multiple reports, which... Kyle Shanahan confirmed afterwards, so the 49ers will have a difficult task of trying to find a new defensive coordinator. For the 49ers, ultimately a disappointing season coming off last season's NFC Championship, 6-10 and 10 finish. Um, of course, the season was marred by injuries to basically all of their important players at, uh, at different spurts throughout, including Nick Bosa, who was lost for the year in week two. So 49ers plan is to get healthy, make some adjustments in the off season. I don't believe that they're going to make a significant change at quarterback, but that remains to be seen. We'll certainly talk about that as time goes on. Um, so the 49ers are going to pick 12th in the NFL draft. And we'll talk about that certainly too, as, as the off season wears on. But um, thanks everybody for checking out 49ers post game buzz after every game. And hopefully next year, we won't have to do this from my, from my spacious room. Instead, we'll be doing it from stadiums, um, all over the league and, and of course the Levi's Stadium for the home games. So thanks for sticking around and we'll talk to you guys soon.